Hi everyone, Liz here, thanks for stopping by. So, I've just had a parcel delivered and it wouldn't go through the letterbox, so the person had to hand me this one. But this here feels a bit strange, so although it looks like a diamond painting, I'm not sure that it is. So, let's get into it and have a look. And see if we can cut this end off. So, I've not opened it and had a look, it has just hot footed it through the letterbox. I'm in a slightly different place in my room. Um, we still seem to be getting a bit of shadow, but not quite as much, hopefully. Uh, but, uh, yeah, oh, <laughs> I know what this is. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I know what this is. This is an oops moment. A very oops moment. Got nothing left in there. Okay, so, as you can see, we have paints and yeah when i was uh, using my coins on aliexpress and thought oh look there's a cheap uh, diamond painting there and it wasn't a cheap diamond painting it was a cheap painting by numbers painting but this one is a different one so let's just have a look at the canvas okay so oh god that's a big roller <laughs> Oh, they've rolled it they've rolled it sort of uh, lengthways rather than that way if you see what i mean right okay so i don't know whether you can quite make that out we've got um a little code as well a little um, pattern to work from as well don't know whether you can make that out okay let me see if there's that oh yes there is apparently paints are easier to get into than diamonds <laughs> Let me just get this little uh, legend out of here. Pop the brushes on one side for a second. See if we've got oh, a picture on here. And yes, we have. So yeah, that's the picture. So we've got a custom of little Millie Moo. So I thought I was ordering a custom diamond painting. Um, and I believe it was 30 by 40. We will give it a measure. Uh, and uh, yeah, it's a painting by numbers of little Millie Moo. So we've got little numbers for the pots there, which, okay, that's unusual. So how many have we got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we've got 24 pots and numbers one to 24. Uh, dear customer, thank you for choosing our product. It is really simple to paint with our number by with our paint by numbers kits. The canvas has different areas marked with a number that matches a specific colour. All you need to do is refer to the colour, match the number on the canvas and the corresponding paint pod, and paint accordingly. Have fun painting. Okay, so let's have a look at these. Paint pot. So have these not? Okay, nice little sort of well, nice-ish little plastic container. I've got a very muted colour palette, but then it is a Scotty dog. Um, so yeah, we're pretty much sort of even on the colours there. Looks like they have got yeah the PF numbers and the code numbers on them. But if you don't want to use the code numbers, they've supplied you with number stickers as well. So that's pretty good. So you've got a choice as to whether you want to use these numbers or the numbers. But to be fair, I'm not quite sure how good that is when the numbers aren't actually in numerical order. So we're starting off 10, 6, 17, 11, 24. <laughs> yeah, I think I would probably prefer to use the paint number, to be honest. Um, are they in any order in the pots? There's 41, that's PF50. So that's that one. Do we start there? That's 51 there. So where's 41? It's 41, the black one, do we think? 640's down here. So yeah, I would have to order those somewhere, um, either using the numbers, but I do think I would probably go on this code here, um, seeing as they are all in number order or number of the uh, code order there okay 
so that's those but yes this was a definite oh dear i ordered the wrong thing um it is years and years since i've done anything painting by numbers we have got some and um, i'll put them back in there later otherwise i'm going to be struggling for hours uh, we have got some painting by numbers um hubby decided he was going to have a go at them and that was as far as it got they arrived and it is never even looked at them i did give one to the granddaughter uh, possibly I might get him interested in this one because it is only 24 colours. You can pay more. Um, I got this on the special offer. Let me just get my olive foot. Oh, right. Okay. So it wasn't that much of a special offer. I actually paid £8.99 for this, which I suppose for a custom painting by numbers, um, which as I say, I think it is a 30 by 40. It looks like it's a true 30 by 40. is a pretty good price. Um... But yeah, it's from AliExpress and it's a shop called Megai, Megai, M-E-G-I, sorry, M-E-G-E-I. Um, so, hmm, okay. But uh, I did order this on the 22nd of January and it, we are middle of February. I think it's 16th of February today. So it has taken quite a while to come. Uh, I suppose they've had to do it and, you know, I have looked at the tracking sometimes and it showed, oh, not coming um, or no information available or whatever. So I was a bit worried it had got lost. So I must admit I had sort of semi forgotten it. But yeah, I say you can pay more and get more colours. But my intention was, well, seeing as um, it's a painting by numbers, I may, um, you know, get a hubby to have a go at doing it. We've got three very fine brushes there, which... Look pretty good. I mean, it'll, it's all down to usage, whether the little hairs start coming out of the bristles, the brushes. But we've got a very fine one there, a sort of a middling one there, and then a little bit thicker one there. I would think that's about a half centimetre uh, brush there. And then we've got a couple of little fastenings, which I'm not quite sure why you get the fastenings, because it's a canvas. Um, I suppose we'll have to put it on a wooden frame. <laughs> I'll have a go at doing it I don't know I don't know when I'll get around to doing it uh but yeah it was just a nice little picture of uh, Millie Moo there and I just thought oh yeah we'll get that one okay so yeah you get your this is um in case you this paper um like code this paper copy is so that if you're painting over any of your sections and you happen to go over a number or you do something wrong you've then got like it's like a key code i suppose um like a map shall we say i can't think of a word to call it oh, brain's gone <laughs> uh so yeah so that you can actually then refer to this and think oh yeah that should have been that color and that should have been that color but these numbers are pretty big on here i mean i haven't got um my magnifying glass but they look pretty darn big to me and pretty good it needs a really good flat now it looks like it's been around the world, judging by the uh, creases and everything in it. But yeah, I mean, it looks pretty good. Doesn't look overly um, complicated as such with it only having the four, uh, 24 colours. So yeah, I think that might come out pretty good. So that will need flattening. Oh dear, that's going to be fun to do. Yeah, we've got your little... Now that is your colour code on there as well as having your little inventory sheet with it as well. So that's pretty good as well. Um, looks like there's plenty of paint. I can't think I'm going to need any more than what's there. So yeah, may or may not be doing this one. I say I'm going to try and get a hobby to do it because I really do think he needs to get a hobby, as it were, try and take his mind off things. So, oh, just a smidge under. 30 there which yeah we're about 29 and a half ish centimeters which is about 11 and three quarter inches by let's have a look let's have a look yeah it's again uh, about 39 and three quarter centimeters which is about 15 and a half inches ish so it's pretty much a 30 by 40. i wish it was a diamond painting um 
but yeah i've probably got hundreds of downloads <laughs> since that i need to do anyway so oh well not to worry um i mean it's it's going to be pretty when it's done i'm not quite sure what they've we're a bit blobby around the eyes. That's quite a big dark colour. I suppose I can add to it myself. Um, mm. I haven't got much of a nose there. That all seems to blend into here as well. Certainly the background. Goodness, the detail on the background is amazing. But uh, yeah, the actual little pup herself is... Mm, maybe. We'll see how it goes. So, oh well, that was... Um, a mistake and not a mistake, shall we say. <laughs> so I've managed to order a painting by numbers, a custom painting by numbers kit. So, okay. Yeah, we'll go with it. We'll see uh, how we go. And uh, if I do get around to doing it, I will let you see it. And if Hubby gets around to doing it, I will let you see it. Okay, well, I don't think I can say any more about this one. Um, pretty comprehensive kit there. If you've enjoyed uh, having a look at this with me, if you can give me a thumbs up, that would be much appreciated. And if you want to come back and see what we get up to next and see what we unbox next, then if you press that subscribe button and the little all notifications bell next to it, you'll be notified when any videos come up that I've done. So thanks ever so much for stopping by and I do hope to see you all again soon. Bye for now.